Hi guys, welcome back to another video on the channel and today we're back. Plymouth Fargoal versus Morecambe today. Different scenery as you may say, I'm going to say it, get out of the way first. I've currently got no chair so I'm doing this standing up. Uh, you might see me waddle about a bit. But our previous three encounters with Morecambe, last time out on the 5th of March 2022, we was victorious at home park in a 2-0 win. Before that, on the 23rd of October 2021 at Morecambe's ground, Argyle came and got a point in a 1-1 draw. And before that, again, on the 14th of December 2019, Argyle were victorious at home park again with a 3-0 win. Now, current league form, Argyle's having a bit of a dip as we speak in, in results and, and how we're playing. But they currently stand second with 44 points. Coming to this game after a 0-0 away draw against Cambridge, a 2-0 home loss to Port Vale. And a 2 2 away draw with Burton. While as with Morecambe, unfortunately for them, they currently stand bottom in 24 for 15 points and coming to this game after a 1 1 draw against Exeter. Before that, a 2 1 loss against Lincoln and before that, a 1 1 draw with Portsmouth. So you look at it like that a, a draw against Portsmouth isn't a bad result for them, a draw against Exeter isn't a bad result for them. Today is going to be. It's going to be chilly. It's going to be cold. We need three points. We need to start bouncing back and getting points against these teams that are far lower in the divisions if we want to look to go, to go up this year. But without further ado, let's get to the stadium. Come on, you greens. And then, so we're in the stadium now. It's about 20 minutes to kick off. Lime surrounds, keeps and goal. Long with Scar, Gillespie as a back three. In the midfield four, Edwards, Randall, Butcher, Mumba. In front of them two, Mayer and Whitaker up front, Ennis. Strong lineup. Um, glad to see Scar back. Obviously, no as as still. Uh, me and my dad spoke about with no as as due to pretty sure he broke his ankle or, or, or done something to his ankle. But gotta be confident today. Obviously, he's the bottom of the league. Uh, they've got a few good draws uh, against the big team decks and I've got a few good draws for them. But we need to we need to get back onto winning ways. I'm gonna go with a three 0 Argyle today. Dad, school prediction. Uh, 4-0. 4-0. High scoring games. Let's have it. Four new games. Now score nil nil missed penalty by Whitaker. We've had the chances. We should be we should be two three goals ahead. I'm disappointed really though in, in the fans. Um, towards the end of the, in the second half, shouting uh, you know a coach for, for playing too slow when there was no options there. Ref blows the foot uh, the half time whistle and there's people booing. We need to sort it out really. We still can win this game. Um, we still have the capability to. We still got 45 minutes shooting towards the Temple end. And, and I believe we can do it. Let's get into it. Thank you. 
Then, full time now, final score 2 1 Greens, uh, vital three points that puts us back top of the league, I believe. After I'm pretty sure Wickham did yeah, beat yeah. Ipswich, um, or, or they, well, I know they for a fact they was winning uh, 1 0, but yeah, this 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 is a good start for us to, to start to regain some some kind of good form, put us in the form that we was in before this little drought that, that we had. Uh, previous, you know, with the with the, the likes of losing to Port Vale at home 2-0, getting 0-0 draws to Cambridge late, late, 
equalises against us against teams like Barton. But I've got to give it to them. Morecambe were a good team. Um, I think obviously Derek Adams reign. This is we are our fans know know how that is. Um, Wickham did win one 0 confirmed, but by the dad. But yeah, uh, I think that they've got a good, a good good little side. I thought their keeper played extremely well. Obviously saving that penalty uh, and, and denying. Nine and there's several on several occasions denying Hardy at the end. You know, Whitaker, Hardy, Ennis, Cosgrove all together could have had about two or three between them. But yeah, yeah we put up behind us now. We've got the three points, that's the main thing. Tuesday, or when I'm pretty sure Wednesday night, we've got our rescheduled cup game against AFC Wimbledon. That's uh, the third round, and the winner of that goes to play Bristol Rovers away from home. Um, in the, in the quarterfinals, this is a good chance for us. You know, the only real big teams left in, in that competition is, I, I believe, Portsmouth, Lincoln, and I would pass pass sales up there. But yeah, we go on to that on t- on Tuesday and Wednesday. I'll see you then. Yeah. Um, see you in a bit, Ben. Um, go on to the 